I be talking about? What's up, gamers? It's your boy, Fat Dallas, aka Mr. Tutty Tutty, bringing you some Madden 18 Ultimate Team tips. Today, we're gonna go over base defense, how to be successful on defense to set your opponent up for blitzes coming off the edge, blitzes coming up the middle, just keeping your opponent guessing because defense is so fun and there's so many different things that you could do. My base defense is 3-4, some people base defense is 3-3-5 and all that other type of stuff. But it's a few key things that you need to keep in your head when you are running a defense and how to be successful with the edge blitzes blitzes up the middle and when you are dropping people back in coverage and making him throw bad passes and then having to pay the, the price for it. First thing you want to do in your base defense is always make sure that you start off with a certain amount of people rushing the quarterback. You don't want to come out right when the game start and only be sending two because a lot of people being that the game is very run heavy, very OP with the run game, you want to make sure that you are sending at least four people at all times. Now, if you got a lead or if it's a fourth and let's say 18 or higher, 18, 19, 20, then you can get away with sending three as long as two is coming up the middle and one is coming up the edge because you want your quarterback accuracy to drop down while he is scrambling. But I'm going to go over a few things. In my 3-4, you can see me blocking everything in the middle and I bait the quarterback now I am in, I'm in the solo with the OOP team the OOP team is pretty decent but we're gonna take another look at this I'm in my base defense I sent four on this I got three coming up the middle and one coming up the edge just like I just showed y'all now the only thing that I did was shift my linebackers toward what tight end was at and I deep blew him so as soon as the quarterback hiked the ball my deep blue is taking steps back when your opponent sees that He's going to think that it's not open, but as he start cutting back across the field, I am slowly lurking because I know my deep blue. I know what zone I put him in, and I know he's supposed to cover 10, 15, or 20 yards down the field. You just want to stay, i say, one or two steps underneath, and then as soon as he throws it, as soon as you see the quarterback's arm go forward, you just lurk that bad boy. 